Hey tennis fans, I'm Grace Carter and this is Tennis Now presented by Tennis Express. Tennis Express, order today and it ships today. A big welcome back to Serena Williams. That's right. We're going to see the 23-time Grand Slam champ this summer as she stunned the sports world announcing that she accepted a wild card into Wimbledon. And this is nuts. It's going to be her 21st Wimbledon appearance. So to get you pumped up, we've got a list of five things we think you should know. To tune up for Wimbledon, Serena's going to double up with a familiar face, not her sister Venus. This time, she's going to partner with world number four, Anne Jabour, in Eastbourne, coming up next week. It'll be Serena's first Eastbourne appearance since 2011 and comes a full 24 years after she made her singles debut there back in 1998, where she reached the quarters as a 16-year-old. Next up, she's got a new coach. Her longtime coach, Patrick Maratoglu, is now coaching Simona Halep. Serena's new coach is Eric Hechtman, who also coaches Venus. Number three on our list, there are streaks at stake. Seven-time Wimbledon winner Serena carries a 98-13 and 13 career record into SW19. She will be playing for a milestone 100th career singles win at the championships, while also trying to snap a very rare current streak. Serena is currently on a two-match losing streak at Wimbledon, the first in her career. Remember, in 2021, she suffered a right hamstring injury and retired in her opener. That match was her first since her 2019 finals loss to Simona Halep. At number two, what kind of shape is she in after all this time off? It's a big question mark because nobody really knows. She's been on the sidelines now for a year. Of course, grass is great for Serena's game. The surface is perfect for her big serves and her explosiveness, so she should be able to play shorter points. On the other hand, grass also demands quick movements, change of direction, and the ability to adapt to low balls. All challenges for a 40-year-old player who's coming off an injury and hasn't played a match in a year. But Serena says she is excited to play and is very much looking forward to the Eastbourne tune-up. And finally, still on her quest to match Margaret Court's record of 24 majors, how much of a threat is a 40-year-old Serena at Wimbledon? She last won in 2016, and her last Grand Slam singles title came five years ago at the 2017 Australian Open. Well, according to bookmakers, Serena is one of the top four favorites to win Wimbledon. Odds checker lists Iga Swiatek, of course, as the strong favorite, followed by Roland Garros runner-up Coco Gauff at 12 to 1, followed by Simona Halep, who's at 14 to 1, and then Serena at 16 to 1 odds. That puts Serena at a that puts Serena ahead of players like Naomi Osaka, Karolina Pliskova, Emma Raducanu, Belinda Bencic, and Angelique Kerber among the Wimbledon favorites. That may be a stretch given Serena's inactivity, but you've got to consider how Serena always brings her best to the slams. After all, she's made it to the final four of her last five appearances. So given her long layoff and her age, do you predict an early exit, or do you see Serena making another statement run at Wimbledon? Join the conversation in the comment section, and we'll see you next time here on Tennis Now.